Hi, Jeff and Juliana. How are you? Hi. Hi. So I loved your scene work together. There's such a sweet playfulness and just a natural spark to your scenes. So for both of you, what did you like best about working with each other? Take it away, Jeff. I'm ready. <laughs> I never had um, such a, I mean it, um, a partner that I felt that I could jam for hours with. It's just, we were dancing together and I never had it. It's so special. Um, we were just playing and improvising <laughs> and it was just, uh, it's beautiful. And um, I'm so, I'm so, I'm so blessed to, to, to have you as a partner, um, Juliana. That's so sweet of you to say. And I feel exactly the same way. And I'll add, I think, you know, the content of the show is often heavy and quite dark. Mm. And perhaps in response to that, um, subconsciously, Jeff and I were just constantly laughing. <laughs> it was like, I, my cheeks hurt from smiling and he's an extremely funny man and seems to think that I can turn out a joke or two. But one thing I will say about working with Jeff, I really, I'm, I admire you, Jeff, so much. And I sort of bow to you. I don't know if you know this, Leora, but English is Jeff's like fourth language and he's a masterful actor in English. I, English is my first and only. And I feel like watching you, Jeff, navigate, navigate, uh, you know, a world that is not a native one, just, Oh, it's so inspiring. You're like a maestro and you make me want to learn another language really well so I can try. Yeah, no, thank acting you. Acting in another language. No, I mean, it's really, wow. I bow to you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. Wow. So I read how in an early scene, Juliana, you were poking Jeff literally. And then Barry Levinson loved it. He said, well, that's what your character does. She pokes him literally and figuratively. Mm -hmm. And it speaks so much about your character dynamic. But I also heard from Karen and Michael, Jeff, that you take everyone's fruit cups. And that if anyone has a fruit cup lying around, watch Danger. out. It's gone. He's, it's just going to eat it. Yeah. So tell me about it's Some gone. Of your favorite memories from set for both of you? Definitely the blueberries. Definitely. <laughs> but I uh, liked the honeydew. <laughs> um. <laughs> so so we we had a lot of fun memories uh, on set. Um. But I was uh, Julianne mentioned uh, my uh, fourth language and English. Um. I was the we had such a great hair and makeup department, and um. Just so every morning to sit there in the makeup chair was just uh, just amazing uh, for all of us. Um, and I was like saying to the to the to the makeup artist, I have so many pickles on my face. Look, I have pickles. Look here, a pickle there, a pickle on my face. And she's like, what do you mean pickles on your face? Look, look how many pickles I have on my face. And then she said, oh, you mean pimples? You mean pimples on your face? Because in Germany, you say for pimples, you say pickles. So uh, that was very, very funny. But we had a lot of um, a lot of laughs and a lot of beautiful moments uh, that we just uh, couldn't stop laughing. So, yeah. 100%. I, yeah, it was a joy working on the show to be in New York, height of summer. Um, I think with another group being in a navy blue suit in the 98 degree, 135 million percent humidity would have been a bit too much. But with them, it was no problem. And well, one thing that I did do is that I introduced Mike Mosley to a cell phone game. And he's now where he was addicted to it, 2048. Um, and it got to a point where every time I looked over at him, he had this like worried look on his face. And I'd say, you lost again? He'd be like, yep, another loss. But he finally got it on, the la on his last day of shooting, he beat the game. So I feel like there's a little poetic justice there. 
Love it. Well, you both had amazing scene partners, amazing collaborators over the years. Who have you worked with in the past that you'd love to work with again, who you found really Whoa. playful and giving? Juliana. Um, the first person who came to mind is Lady Diane Lane, who is just the classiest broad who ever lived. Um, I just adore her. But honestly, I've worked only with uh, miraculous, wonderful, experienced, genius actors. I'm very lucky. Yeah, it will, for me, it would be also very hard to pick, but I think Juliana Canfield. Will be, oh my God, you! I would like to work again. <laughs> well, that's a given. We're going to work together. True, sure, true. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> and what have the two of you been watching lately that you've really enjoyed? Ooh. You first, Jeff. I watched yesterday, I started watching um, Bel Air on Peacock. I loved it. Ooh. I loved it. Yeah. Great. Fun. Yes. Took me by surprise. I loved it. Yeah. I have not been watching much television lately. Um, busy filming and doing stuff. Yeah. Or I don't know, just staring at the ceiling. But for the first time last night, I watched Reality Bites, the Ben Stiller movie. Um, and I can't believe I've never seen it before, but it's worth a rewatch or a first watch if you were like me. Yes, I love it. Well, thank you both so much for the art that you bring into the world. I really appreciate it. Thank you for taking the time. Have of a lovely course. day. Thank you. You Thanks too. Bye-bye. Thank you so are. much. Take care. Thank you. Bye. Ta -ta